Hey guys, it's me again. And I'm walking around looking at these beautiful granite rocks that we see on people's countertops all over the country. And I look down at this rock and I see one that looks like it's covered in carpet. Can you see it? There's some great algaes here. Some algaes, you already saw those. Here's this Sasquatch fur algae. <laughs> Please don't tell anybody that's what I said because it's not right. It looks like Sasquatch fur. This is lettuce algae though, that's the correct name. It looks just like lettuce. You see it growing all over this rock, but that's not all that's here. If we pull some of the algae back and look real close, you can see these barnacles. These barnacles have attached themselves to the rock and they, oh, that was a great picture. Notice that the water just came up and didn't wash them away. They are stuck to the rock. They are not coming off. These, these things live in a pretty harsh environment. They pick up just little bits of water and uh, plankton and stuff as it rolls over. They don't get to stay in the water all the time. So it gets hot, it gets wet, and they have really got to hold on when these big ships come by. They've got to really hold on. What else is down here? If we look close and dig around a little bit, I know I saw one a little bit ago, we'll find a snail. I showed you a snail earlier. There's a I swore I saw a snail, my foot just got wet. <laughs> oh, anyway, all these things are living. They're holding fast to this rock. And Mrs. Hillman just talked to you about the turtles that'll come up and eat um, some of these things. The barnacles, they're really just gonna kind of grind this rock up. They're a pioneer species. They're gonna live and die and live and die. And in a million years, this rock will be gone and uh, so will we. Um, but I wanted to kind of raise up and, and show you some life that depends on this algae. The turtles are in here. So are a bunch of different types of fish. The red fish that Chris is fishing for over here. And there's a sea trout, catfish. You can't even name them. You guys can look in a book and see so many different types of fish. But these birds you see flying around, they're depending on these fishermen, the turtles, the fish. And if we're real patient, we'll be able to see a pelican fly by or float by. And I just cut that. <laughs> 